In this video I'm going to show you how to install and use this Windows Auto Typer. I've been getting a lot of questions on how to use this so here's the video. First we're going to need to install the script and then we'll download the actual Auto Typer that will type for us. But both of these things are essential for the Auto Typer to work. So let's start by installing the script. So first we'll go to the pryphacker.in and it will bring you here. So you want to click on this second post from the top. You'll just read the title. So click on that. And here in this article it will tell you all, everything you need to know about the autotyper and how to use it properly like without getting banned and stuff. So you can read through this if you would like. Uh, but I'm going to go down here and click on script. So click on script and it will take you here. So if you haven't installed it yet, click on install. But since I have it installed it already, it says reinstall. So I'll just click on it anyways. Once you click on it, it will bring you to this blank page. That means you've installed it. So just close this page. And so now we are done installing the script. That's all we have to do with the script from now on unless you need to reinstall it when there are new updates or something like that. So next we need to download the NitroTyper bot. And to do that you will scroll down to this section of the article and click on Windows. Since I'm on Windows right now I'm going to choose Windows but if you're on Linux or Mac then you will want to ch choose those. But I'm going to go with Windows and then click on Get Bot. and then click on fetch and it's gonna take a second to fetch it I guess so just wait for it for a second until it fetches. and then once it's done you'll, be, you'll click on go to link and then click on download and then click on download NT Alright, here we are. Now you can name it whatever you want. I'm gonna name it not um, Nitro Typer Newest, and then click on Save, and then I'm gonna open the zip file. So you'll do the same thing, right? Open the zip file, click on Nitro Typer 5. Point, no 543 Windows open it up and then we're gonna open up the natural typer so click double click on it click on run and it will open up this actually let me make it smaller so this is the auto typer right now all you have to do is now leave the auto typer open okay now go to natural type before you use the auto typer, make sure you're not using an account that you don't want to get banned because if you accidentally type too fast or something like that, then you'll get banned. So just make sure you're using some an account that you don't mind getting banned on. If you if it, if it's your first time, try it on a new account. So create a new account and try it on that on that account instead. As you can see, we have about five di different modes, uh, but we're only going to use like three of them. Actually, we have like six different ones. So the zero one is zero. Code zero is for testing purposes. It that one is, I believe, it just sets up the speed and everything, and it just types. It just races and it's gonna race once, just for testing purposes, I guess. So I, I don't think it's that useful. Now the next one is single, which is code one. Now this one, you just set up one race and it just does one race that's all compared to the other ones like multi and advanced which they do multiple races you can set them up to do multiple races but single just does one race so let me just start with single and I'll show you the other ones afterwards so let me just show you so as you can see the code is one so you would type one and then press enter and then enter speed less than one less than eleven thousand one hundred words per minute. So I'm gonna do like one hundred words per minute. So just type one hundred. That's all you need. And then press on enter. 
and then next we need accuracy we need it to be above 85 so let's do like 98 percent next do you want to use nitro or not zero is for no one is for yes so i'm in i'm gonna choose one which is yes enter now press one and hit enter to activate the bot so you press one press enter now you need to join a race within the next minute so click on race now i guess we'll join a race And here we go. Just so you know, my hands are right here. I'm not typing. It looks like it's typing 111 right now, but it will adjust eventually to... So it's going to end up with about 100 words per minute. Yep. 106 words per minute pretty close so that is what the single mode does that just does one race so if you want to race again with that mode you'd have to set it up again and go now multi mode and advanced mode are the same thing but you get more options with the advanced mode so let me just show you the multi mode real quick and then I'll show you the advanced mode which is my favorite so let me just show you the multi mode real quick though so multi mode the code is 2 so we'll type 2 right and press enter number of races so number of races how many times do you want it to race so that means you can just set it up and you don't have you don't even have to set it up again until it has completed all those races let me just do two races just for the video so press enter I'm gonna make it do two races enter speed less than 250 and the reason for that is if you set it up to type more than 250 it's gonna get your account is getting get banned like in about 10 races or so so there's no point in letting you type more than that so let's just do 100 again and press enter randomize speed with the multi mode it just randomizes the speed like if you set it up to do 100 races then it will randomize it between about 95 and 105 I think that's how it is so by about five rate by about five words per minute difference I guess so we do want to randomize it I suggest that you do randomize it so let's click on one uh, for yes enter accuracy 97 randomize accuracy yes so next step is use your natural nitro yes randomize nitro use yes press one and hit to activate the button press one enter all right now let's go race So remember I said it to do two races so after this race it's gonna do another race by itself I don't have to set it up again it's yeah just like that it joins the race by itself yep you don't have to do anything now I just set it up to do two races but you can set it up to do whatever races you want Alright, that's it now. It won't do any more races because I only set it to do two races only. Next up, 
let's try the advanced mode. The code for the advanced mode is 3. So we'll get on here. Type 3. Enter. Number of races. So how many races do you want to do? You can set it up to do 1000 races if you wanted to. So let's just do 3 races. Just for the video. Alright, so next we need to enter the upper limit enter upper limit speed so what that means is if for example if you wanted to do between what between 10 and 50 words per minute speed randomly the upper limit would be 50 so in this case I'm gonna want it to be 130 and click and I mean enter now lower limit speed now what do you want to be the lower I want me uh, Let's do 90. So that means it's gonna tie between 90 and 130 word, words per minute in the next three races that I set it up to do. Upper limit of accuracy, same thing here. So I'm gonna do 99. Lower limit of accuracy, accuracy. And then let's do 90. Use nitros, yes or no. I'm gonna choose one, which equals to yes. Random nitro. So I'm going to choose yes actually. Minimum delay between races. How much time do you want to delay be be before the next race starts? So let's just do uh, 3,000 maximum. Let's do 5,000 which equals to 5, th 5 seconds I believe. Disqualification and timeout shield yes or no. We're, obviously we're just going to choose yes. Press 1 and hit enter. 1 enter and that's it now like I said you can set it up to do whatever however many races you wanted to do but I'm choosing three just for this video That's the first race done. And it restarts by itself. Here's the second race. And there's a third race. And that's the third race and that's it. Now if you go back here it will show you all the things that happened. Stats of the session, you know. Uh, so the bot has been around for 1 minute and 44 seconds. Average speed 102 words per minute, average accuracy 94%, average lessons 